the lecture i'm going to find the difference between gate path gate absolute path and gate canonical path in java programming so this is the code to create the files there i'm using gate absolute path this you get the description about gate absolute path canonical path and gate path so if i run this code now here i am getting the path so there I could not uh, identify what exactly the difference between this twos, this uh, threes. So let's take here another example. So this is about uh, this is about absolute path. So absolute path is a path that describes the location of a file or folder, regardless of current working directory. Okay, current working directory, regardless. Canonical path is an absolute path. It is always unique and if the path is not absolute, it convert into absolute path. And clean up the path by removing or resolving stuff like dot and resolving symbol like this dot or double dot and the gate path. So it is neither the absolute path or not the canonical path. So if I run this code, now here you can see there I supply the path dot dot backward slash dot backward slash dance dot txt. So this is the absolute path. And here you can see this is the canonical path and gate path. So easily you can identify the difference absolute path so first here i'm going to see user adam eclipse sam so here moving c so let's move on the c drive user adam eclipse workspace now here you can see So the exact location of the file is C user Adam Eclipse. But when I use the absolute path, so absolute path uh, giving the uh, its file inside the Eclipse, but it's taken one more directory SAM. After that, uh, that uh, uh, is located the file dance.txt. So when you use here the absolute path then you can get this location so it uh, doesn't care about the current working directory okay but here the next is canonical path so canonical path uh, here with the help of canonical path so the file location inside the eclipse work space okay so after uh, when you supply dot dot and backward slash dot so it resolve for uh, this kind of symbols and give the ac actual uh, location of the path and uh, here or uh, about the gate path so whatever the uh, file uh, whatever the location that given inside there so that th it's uh, returning so it doesn't care about the absolute path and gate canonical path okay so this is the difference between these threes so it uh, with the help of canonical path it it's so uh, uh, it is uh, unique and here path is not absolute and then it convert and clear out the path by removing uh, or resolving a uh, stuff like dot and dot dot resolving symbol so this is the three difference between get absolute path then after canonical path and get file get path so i hope guys you understand the differences so now in this video it's over so thanks for watching see you next week thank you